In this review article, we discuss studies that have examined the role of basal forebrain cholinergic neurons in mediating fear and extinction memory. So these are behavioral paradigms often used to measure fear and extinction memory. A is Pavlovian fear conditioning, B condition suppression, C fear potentiated startle, and D inhibitory avoidance. It's often assumed that the fear and extinction circuitry in these paradigms are the same, yeah, the only difference being what neural substrate mediates the output of the behavior. Upon reviewing the role of basal forebrain cholinergic neurons in mediating fear and extinction memory, one of the things that I discovered is that it would appear that the circuitry uh, that mediates fear and extinction memory in these paradigms can sometimes be a, a little different. Where cholinergic neurons are, are really important in some paradigms, not important in other paradigms, and have different roles in yet other paradigms. In this slide, we summarize the basal forebrain cholinergic system. In A, we show uh, neural circuits. Uh, we're leaving out preoptic uh, cholinergic neurons because those neurons are not manipulated in the studies that I reviewed. Uh, essentially, we show MSDBB cholinergic neurons that have projections to the hippocampus as well as to the cortical regions, and NBM cholinergic neurons that have projections to the neocortex and the entire neocortical mantle and the amygdala. In B, we show the cholinergic synapse, which in addition to cholinergic receptors express uh, neurotrophic receptors such as TRK receptors and a P75 receptor that binds NGF. So this slide summarizes uh, what's known about BF amygdalopetal cholinergic neurons. Uh, these neurons are critical, well they reside in the NBM, projected the BLA, and are critical for cued fair memory uh, and trace fair memory, but this is in the Pavlovian fair conditioning paradigm. Not so important for fair memory at all in fair potentiated startle. And they seem to be important for contextual fair memory, uh, as well as potentially contextual extinction in the inhibitory avoidance paradigm. Uh, in A, we show neural circuits that are potentially critical for this. B, molecular processes. And C, electrophysiological processes. Uh, in general, it would appear that BF amygdalopetal cholinergic neurons potentiate input from auditory cortical neurons onto BLA principal neurons. And that general electrophysiological phenomena is a way that uh, BF amygdalopetal cholinergic neurons modulate uh, fair memory. Uh, me mechanisms for extinction memory sort of remain unknown. NBM cholinergic corticopetal cholinergic neurons are typically targeted by using toxins that target the P75 receptor because these neurons are the only neurons in the basal forebrain that express this receptor. NBM corticopetal cholinergic neurons are really critical for fair memory in the condition suppression paradigm, but not in the Pavlovian paradigm or in fair potentiated startle paradigm. In the inhibitory avoidance paradigm, uh, some reports suggest that these neurons inhibit fair memory formation while others report that they are critical for the modulata modulatory effects adrenal hormones have on fair memory formation. In A, we show neural circuits via which NBM corticopetal cholinergic neurons could facilitate uh, fair memory, and uh, B, electrophysiological mechanisms. MSDBB cholinergic neurons are projected the dorsal hippocampus, seem to be critical for uh, fair contextual fair memory and contextual fair extinction memory. Uh, this uh, studies use optogenetic manipulations and uh, pharmacological manipulations. Interestingly, studies that use permanent lesions don't, don't see any effect at all, and the reason for the discrepancy remains unknown. MSDBB cholinergic neurons are also critical for acquisition of fair extinction in a relatively novel way, and so animals with uh, lesions of MSDBB cholinergic neurons can't distinguish uh, contextual fear from one context to another. So if they generalize fear, this results in high levels of baseline freezing during uh, extinction training, and just high levels of fear during extinction training and testing. Uh, in A, we show hypothetical neural circuits, and B, molecular processes. So that's it for the review. The review pointed to a number of novel hypotheses that uh, require testing. One in particular is why do B of cholinergic neurons seem really important in fair memory and possibly extinction memory in some paradigms, but others. And then, you know, we'd like to determine if these cholinergic neurons can be manipulated to treat excessive fear and anxiety disorders. I would like to thank the following people for their help with the review. That's about it.